it's the beginning of a new week, Rev Crew. Happy Monday. I have a warm up and a workout for you. Four short rounds, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off. You got this. Okay, warm up, Tabata. So you're gonna set your timer, your interval timer, for eight rounds, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. If you don't have one, go get one from your app store. There's lots of free options. Okay, it's a really helpful tool when you're working out at home. We're gonna go not Tabata of one movement. We're gonna go 20 seconds of squats, 20 seconds of lunges, 20 seconds of push-ups, and then 20 seconds of pump stretch. We'll go through that two times for a total of eight rounds. We'll do each movement twice. Of course, after you're done with that Tabata, if you need more warm-up, take your time and do it. Stretch out and get ready to move. Then, our workout of the day is four rounds, 30 seconds on, 30 seconds off of the following movements. We're gonna do thrusters. If you have one weight, you can go single arm thrusters. If you have a torpedo or you have two weights, you can go both. That's up to you. If thrusters are not working because you're not going overhead, goblet squats will do the trick or air squats. 30 seconds on air squats if you're moving hard, moving fast can get difficult. Um, Alright, so we got thruster. Option one would be squats. If you're not squatting but you want to do something that will get your heart rate elevated like a thruster, go to push press. Alright, and same thing. You can go two arms or one arm with that. Just switch halfway through your 30 seconds. Or by round because today we have an even number of rounds. Next movement, after you rest for 30 seconds, is a two push up burpee. Okay, I'm going to show you up in the corner here what that looks like. And then 30 seconds of rest, and your lunges. Your choice, forward, backward, however you like. If lunges are getting to you, you can do stair step ups, chair step ups, or box step ups instead. And then 30 seconds of rest. Moving into mountain climbers, and only going to be there. Next will be kettlebell swings. If you don't have a kettlebell, you can swing your dumbbell. You can also swing a slam ball, but it might take some doing to get there, and you might prefer to do deadlifts with it. That's fine. We're looking to get out your posterior chain and your, and your core there, so deadlifting works just as well. Up next we have sit-ups. If you don't have an ab mat, tuck your toes underneath of something, the edge of your couch or something, and just hold them down, and that'll help support your back as you do your sit-ups. Then I'm adding in a lat pull down or a lat raise today. So if you have soup cans, you can do a lat raise or light dumbbells. If you happen to have bands that you can attach up at the top of a doorway, you can do lat pull downs. So um, last minute will be rest, a full 60 seconds of rest, and then you begin again, a total of four rounds. All right guys, enjoy that workout. Let me know if you have questions or need some movement substitution ideas.